What is up, lads and lasses? It is Sunday Games Gaming here, and we are back with some more Walking Dead, the Telltale, the Telltale video game, and uh, <clears throat> we are continuing uh, the latter half of Episode Three, a long road ahead. And uh, I could rewind it, but I'm not going to. We want to continue. We don't want to play from the beginning. We wanted to play from where we left off. Because um, I had to cut it short last time, but that's okay. Because, you know, we got this here. And we're good. And we're raring to go. Yes. So, as you remember, it's kind of backed up a little bit. We are now have arrived here. We're going to have a little bit of a replay. But, uh, no big, big, biggity, big, biggity. So here we go. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clem, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? Hadn't crossed my mind. Ha! Alright, it's time to... Let's talk to some peoples. How's that? I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Probably. Exactly. Would you have left Lily back there? On the side of the road like that? Yes, Lee. Yeah? We have to have lines. Yes, I would have left her. Okay, then. Has Clementine said anything to you about Carly or Duck or anything? <coughs> I'm worried about her. No. <laughs> that little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Poor Carly. God, where did yesterday go? I don't know. Are, taking the are you really okay? Awful, I know you were fond of her. I was. This isn't any time for, you know, romance, but yeah. I was, uh, fond of her, yeah. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. Hey man, we're still looking around and haven't figured much out yet. It's fine. Radiator could use a rest as it is. Let's talk to Clem Clem. Hey, Hi, sweet Clem Pete. Clem. You okay out here? I don't think Duck feels good. Uh, me neither. Alright, time to go talk to her. B -b Billy Bob, Billy, Billy, Bill, Bill, Bob, Billy, Billy, Ben. <clears throat> Was it you? Not this again. Was it? No! Okay then. What would you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. You, uh, happy you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods. Just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. oh. The door to the boxcar. Time to go exploring, y'all. Let's do it. Whoa. Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit. Think they're gone? 
I hope so, but this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Yeah, bro. I'll take this to Kanja for Duck. A clipboard. A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. Word. Let's climb on out. That's one hell of a mess. Well, that's one hell of a mess, Ross. I did on spot. Yeah. <clears throat> Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's Perfect allergic seal. to bees. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. And clipboard. We found Cannon. this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. These tracks lead right to Savannah. Holy hell. Can you guys see about moving that thing? We could have something here. Yeah, we're on it. We on it. We on it. We, we, we on it, on it. We, we, we on it, on it. Um, let's go this way first. A switch. Nothing. All right, all right, all right, all right. <clears throat> Might be something inside. There you go. Spanner, monkey wrench, spike remover. I like the monkey wrench. I'm just saying I should be able to take all three, but whatever. And of course, as soon as I start playing this, my dogs go crazy. They've been quiet all day. I'm just saying. Well, maybe they haven't gone crazy. Thank God. I forgot how much I like this game. Ain't nothing here. Suppose we gotta look him over. Yeah. <sighs> don't think it was a walker. I know it wasn't a walker, but... Ouch. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it! Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. Ask Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. Well, let's look around. 
Maybe it'd go somewhere we'd like to be. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. Hey, Ken. What's up? I don't know about leaving Lily back there. Abandoning someone on the side of the road is the same as murder. Don't worry about it. We just would have had to deal with her eventually. You want to talk about Duck? I'm really sorry, Kenny. Nobody deserves this. There's nothing to talk about. You heard Cat. He could be fine. We probably shouldn't ignore that. Nobody's ignoring nothing. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be either. God, we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when we're working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys. We can figure it out. I'll get back to it. Me too. A bunch of maps about Georgia cities. Nothing about the train. <coughs> Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Find a way to read the notepad. Well, I already know how to do it. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. Gonna check the RV for a pencil, the RV. <laughs> for a pencil, gonna check the RV For a pencil, yeah, yeah Is that the only thing? A pencil, sharpened too <laughs> Yoink Nah, let's do TFO <clears throat> Gonna check the RV. Nope. For a pencil. We already did the gonna etch a sketch. It's not really etch a sketch, but I'm gonna do this anyway. Boom. Boom. Gonna do I forget. Well, Perfect. You can read it now? Oh, yeah. yeah. Should be yeah, able to just it. follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. Six, five, nine, nine. All right, so. How do I? Six is down, down, up, 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 down, up, down, down, up, 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 down, up, down, down, up, 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 down, up. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! So far, so good. Five is sideways and then vertical. This one is sideways. That one's now vertical. we're talking. All right, number three. Let's try number three. No, all right, I can't try number three. So, oh, I think it's over here. It's this one. Might be something inside. That's not what I meant to press. Here we go. 
Alright, so... First to the left, then to the right. Low oil. Prime. Holy shit! We're golden! What about Duck? What about him? Look, Kenny, it's something we're gonna have to deal with. Did you not hear Cat? We don't know shit, Lee. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. <sighs> Your son's gonna die. It's all yours. Damn it! Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck and get us unstuck? Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Okay. All right. Thank you. Go back up. Go back up. I need something. I need to uh, get the spike out. <laughs> Make weird noises, I apologize. I need you. I think I need you. Hey, Kenny, we're loose! Kick, 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 Kenny, 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 Kenny. You touch any of my stuff? I took the map of the train routes. That's fine. You can have that. Really? Yeah. I got them all right up here. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab? Him, too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warmed to me right quick in direct sunlight. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, <laughs> Ben too. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. Wrong. I can offer y'all whatever I got. Although it ain't much. Thank you. 
We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on... Uh... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Yeah, bro. Don't be such a doucher. Alright, it's time to talk to some mofos. Let's talk to... Hey, Chuck. Chuck. Howdy. Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Fine, then. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. You still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. That's some kind of something. Some I'll talk to you later. Wonderful. Hope so. That's a song. I better get back to it. Guess I have absolutely nothing else to say to Katja about Doug. All How right. How you doing, Ben? I'm watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? He's bitter. Hey, sweet pea. That candy Chuck gave you. It tastes okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste? No. Train's cool, huh? I guess. Scary, kind of. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. Haven't found anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Hey, 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 hey. You don't talk to her like that, motherfucker. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. We can keep going if you want. Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, cat. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. I could have sworn there was some other issues before this. Gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. There were more of us. Dad, get them? No. Ah, living got them. Lee! Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's a... Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please?
He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. I'm gonna go get Kenny. Hold on tight in case the train stops fast. Ought to get this train stopped right quick. Ought to get this train stopped right quick. La da 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 da. I'm walking outside a moving train. Walking outside a moving train. I'm walking, walking outside. Walking, 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 walking. Wicked, wicked, wicked. Walk, walk, walking, walking. Do the moonwalk. Walking outside a train. What? It's moving. And it's a train, and I'm walking outside of it. <clears throat> you need to stop the train. Kenny. Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. That's it. Wake the fuck up, man. This is over. He's dead. Don't you tell me to wake up. I got a real family I'm trying to protect. Not that fucking sham you're running back there! Oh no, you didn't, motherfucker. I don't know what the hell is wrong with you, but you need to lock it up. Be a man here. Oh, you want a piece of me? Is that it? I just want to talk, Ken. Relax. Then talk. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. You're in denial. And you've given up on Duck, on everyone. Stop it, goddammit. Fuck you, Lee. You're gonna listen. Or what? Am I really gonna have to fight him? Do I have to do that? Is that a thing? Because I kind of don't. Knock this shit off. So, you want to fight then? Let's just talk, man. Whatever. Uh... You think you're the reason Duck was bitten? Like you had this coming or something? You didn't kill Herschel's son. Yes, I did. And now it's catching up to me. That's not what went down. You looked out for your kid, and a bad thing happened to someone else's. There ain't no way this world lets my son live when I help put someone else's in the ground. That's not the way it works. You know that. Stop the train, man. Oh, yeah. That's a friendship, sort of. Friendship out of necessity, then. Achievement unlocked. Handle it. I know I'm being a little lighthearted during uh, dramatic stuff, and I apologize to anybody who hasn't seen this already, but I have played this before. So, it's a little less emotional. It's still sad, but I'm sure part two I'll be much more serious. Ken, it's. I think it's time. The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... 
Come on, Cap. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hun? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. Gotcha. Fuck. I, I, I can. I can do this. I'll do it. No, it should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. Lee's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest? So Clementine doesn't have to see. Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. What's happening? Duck is dying. I know. What are you doing? I'm putting him out of his misery. Things are... What the... No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. The drama, though. Cat! Cat! Gotcha! Why? Cat? Honey? Oh, fucking God! <laughs> oh my God. I... I... Hey, wake up. Ignore that. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. I never liked this part. Of course, I mean, why would you? 